No, I would definitely agree with that. One of the things that when you talk about all the possible solutions, I would encourage people if they're doing this exercise to just let themselves go. Mind map it out. Just mm -hmm. put down just the silly stuff. Even if you get everything that you can think of possible solutions and then think uh, uh, Chick Thompson talks about this in his TED talk, you know, brainstorming and coming up with new huge ideas, you know, once you've felt like you've got to the end of your rope and you're like, I don't have any more ideas. I, I don't know what to do. Ask yourself, what would I never do? Like, mm -hmm. I need to fix this problem, but what are the things I would never, ever do? And yes. then start writing those down. And you'd be surprised, well, why wouldn't I never do that? And when you think about it in that way, sometimes it opens up new channels and you think of things differently. And all of a sudden it's like, wow, okay, well, what, how could I actually do that? And you might be surprised how many solutions come out of your never list. I absolutely. Another spin on that I've heard is if someone says, well, I, I just can't think of anything. Then the suggestion is, well, if you could think of something, what would it be? So it just <laughs> opens up the door. You know? Yeah. So just put things down as silly as you, yeah, absolutely silly. And you can always thin it down later. That's why you talk about what's the best solution. You start scratching things out, mm -hmm. you put down things that even though you know they're impossible, just put them down and then like, so you can always thin it out later because you'd be surprised the synthesis of ideas that come about. Absolutely. But These are the things that, you know, a lot of people might say, well, this is kind of common sense. Well, it might be common sense, but uncommonly used is what we like to tell our, our listeners here today. Very true. And, I, and a lot of times in a couple of episodes, we've talked about common sense too. Well, some things are simple, but not easy. Mm -hmm. Very simple to lose weight, uh, exercise more, eat less. If it was, if it, it was as easy as it was simple, the whole diet industry would be out of business. That's right. Oh, well, here's the thing. I think most times people prefer comfortable problems versus uncomfortable solutions. So back to our formula, taking yeah. action. Maybe we don't want to take that action because it's going to mean more work or it's going to mean disrupting our routine. No, hey, listen, you want to change, you got to, you got to get into action here. It's, it's kind of like this. If you keep on doing what you've always done, you'll keep on... And most getting what say, you've always gotten. Yeah, yeah that, that's what most people will say. However, I got to tell you something else. A better way to look at it is if you keep on doing what you've always done, you're going to get less of what you always got because the world has changed and continues to change. And if we don't just keep pace with the change, we're going to fall behind very quickly.